Warning, there may be yelling in this video. My goal is 400 subscribers before September. If I hit 400 subscribers before or after the deadline, I will do a mega collab with myself and five of my friends. For some reason, I almost accidentally say me and four of my friends instead of five every single time, literally. I don't get why. One thing I urgently need to do is have Jake the Fox get Discord. Fortunately, by the way, I'm getting nice with this video. Fortunately, it's summer real soon, real soon for me. So I'll have a lot, a lot more evenings available to have a sleepover with Jake the Fox, all right? I mean, I don't have an official job, all right? And I can always like, well, unless people, well, unless the people who I mowed lawns for actually need me at their house, I can always like say, okay, I can do this later at like five o'clock instead of like two. I don't know, actually, I don't know. I forget when I, there's not really like specific times really but like you know it's fine if I have a sleep over the day before I I move on and even if I had work the next day I think I'd be all right too because you know well sleepovers at Jake the Fox I get like nine ten hours of rest all right Jake the Fox doesn't stay up all night so it's not like I'm wrecked the entire next day and his guest room his guest room bed is really good all right um yeah it's either that or I, all beds are fine to me because, you know, um, I'm a type of person who doesn't need a lot to be satisfied, all right? Um, now, I'm not trying to say anything bad about Jake the Fox's guest room, all right? I'm not saying it is bad. I don't think it's bad. If it is bad, then I couldn't tell. But if it is bad, well, no. If it's not bad, which I don't, I really don't think it's bad, but to be honest, I can't tell. What I'm saying is I'm not trying to um, yell, yell. I'm not trying to say anything bad about Jake the Fox's guest room. I think it's great, all right? I can't believe I'm talking about Jake the Fox's guest room in a YouTube video. So today I'm gonna be talking about peer pressure, all right? And it is a real thing, all right? Peer pressure is when your peers, your friends, pressure into you into doing something. I'll give you a perfect example. I used to do the Koopa show, so I have somewhat of experience of like acting out voices, all right? Three, two, one, go. Hey, Timmy! Hey, you wanna come over here and uh, uh, drink a fourth bottle of soda, a fourth bottle of Dr. Pepper? I mean, I know your parents don't want you to. They don't want you drinking a fourth bottle of Dr. Pepper today. Or can, I don't know, bottle, yeah, bottle, I'll say bottle, not can, I'll say bottle. Uh, your parents don't want you drinking a fourth bottle of Dr. Pepper, but come on, do it! Wait, what was the original character's name? Timmy. Alright, yeah, Timmy. Yeah, Timmy! Drink a fourth bottle of Dr. Pepper! I can't really do that! No! No, Tammy! No! Don't peer pressure me into drinking a fourth bottle of Dr. Pepper! Come on! Come on, Timmy! Do it! Do it! Drink a fourth bottle of Dr. Pepper! Do it! Do it! Yeah! Yeah! You heard, Theodore! Do it! Do it! T Timmy, drink the fourth bottle of Dr. Pepper. Do it, do it. No, don't peer pressure me, guys. Tammy, Tally, and Theodore, don't peer pressure me. No, no, don't do that to me. Oh my goodness gracious, don't do that to me. No, goodness gracious, I'm not gonna do that. All right, we won't be your friend then. Come on, do it, do it. All right, fine. My water bottle fell right over when I was trying to act like drinking a, a bottle of Dr. Pepper. What am I doing anymore in this YouTube channel? Have I gone insane? Anyways, peer pressure is more commonly used in more serious situations. And I know I give a very goofy example, but I'm being serious. Oh my gosh. Alex, Astro Alex just DM'd me 18 times. Calm down. Holy crap. Goodness gracious, can't you? Actually, I don't have Do Not Disturb on, but couldn't you at least see him in the server? Eh, that's fine. All right, that's fine. He's probably wondering where I am. But anyways, um, I know, like, I gave a goofy example, but I'm being serious here. And some more serious situations can occur. I'm not going to explain them directly, but, like, stuff that involves legal stuff, all right? Um, your friends may peer pressure you into doing that stuff. Well, let me tell you, your real friends won't do that. Your so-called friends will peer pressure into you into doing stuff. A real friend 
cares about your feelings and won't make you feel and won't force you to do something if you don't want to do it because they care about you they want you to be happy they don't want you to um be they don't want you to be uncomfortable just for them to be happy because of um something that they want you to do no no a real friend would respect you and say all right you don't want to do that then you don't have to do that that's what a real friend would do they consider your feelings your fake friends would um say come on do this come on do this or else I'm not going to be friends with you anymore. That's a fake friend, all right? Obviously, they don't care about you. They're not considering that you're very uncomfortable about um, doing something. And they're only thinking about themselves. So they're threatening to not be your friend um, just, for, just for their convenience, all right? That is, well, yeah, I guess I'm helping you to find a fake friend between a real friend, all right? And I'm very happy to share these life lessons with people, all right? I really am. I can't believe I'd actually ever be giving life advice, but I'm just saying what I know, and yeah. I hope a lot of people get to see this, all right? Like, for the people who don't know, because that'd be really, really cool to know if I knew that I am spreading a positive message. Also, I'm trying to get on top of the rock. I don't think I'm going to get past... I think I'm going to need the second stick of dynamite, unfortunately. What? What's going on here with this? But anyways, yeah, that's peer pressure. Yep. So never listen to peer pressure, all right? Also, I do something funny, not to make fun of it, but what I do to be funny sometimes is I'll be like, <gasps> excuse me, the sneeze wasn't a part of it. Um, I'll be like, oh, you're peer pressuring me. Oh my gosh, I'm too strong for your peer pressure. Your peer pressure has no match against me. And I'll do that in front of Yugo and VR as a joke, and he will laugh his butt off, and he will also do that, like, as a joke. Like, he'll be like, ooh, you're not peer pressuring me. I'm too strong for your peer pressure. You're trying to peer pressure me. You know, we, we like to, like, make light of it, all right? Now, obviously, it's just a joke. We're not making fun of it, all right? We're not bad people, all right? Obviously, I'm not trying to make fun of it. I mean, I just sat down and did, like, a whole explanation on it, so... Why would I be making fun of it, you know? You know? Alright, I was... I got off track. I was messaging a couple friends, alright? Um, well, actually, I already talked about what I needed to talk about in this episode. But, you know, the rocks are back by now. But, you know, it was defeat, like, once that tree was up there. Because I had to, like, do the whole thing where I chopped down the tree. Um, and get to that ice tree. So, it, it would have been too late anyway. Um, but I can't believe that... My next stream, as of when recording this video, and probably when this video is coming out, which I'm guessing maybe Thursday, I don't know though, but there's a live stream Friday morning at 7 a.m., all right? This week's Friday, unless this video is coming out after that Friday, Friday, June 10th, 7 a.m., all right? Um, I can't believe that a week went by so quickly. It, uh, five days for me, I'm recording this on Sunday, five days until the stream. Oh my gosh, that's crazy. I'm almost at the next stream. I'll be playing some more versus Dave and Bambi Golden Apple, hopefully five nights at Expunged. But for some reason, some of the controls don't work, or maybe I'm just not hitting the right button. So I have to figure out how to really use the controls. There's no, like, settings on that game or whatever that tells you what controls do what, like how to uh, turn on the lights and close the doors. I can check the cameras, but that's it. I can't turn on the or off the lights or close the doors now five nights at expunged is like five nights at freddy's all right it's like the thing where you sit in a room and then you got to look through the cameras then you got to close the door if like characters come near you know it is yeah basically five nights at freddy's but with dave and bambi characters and that's why i really want to play it and expunged my favorite dave and bambi character is the main character in that game oh my gosh and also they overplay apple core in that song like i love the expunged instrumental part of apple core all right but you know it actually you know what it doesn't annoy me all right i was about to say it does but now that i think of it no it doesn't annoy me but yeah they it might annoy you i don't know if it does but um they like overplay the tune da 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 but i really like that they do that like they have like it play when expunged appears they have it play in the the um the end credits they have it play whenever it it says um 5 a.m to 6 a.m like when the night's over yeah oh my gosh seven views in an hour i will take that that is good yeah that's um i a video premiered about an hour ago for me 
All right, all right, time to sell this wood. All right, just watch. Get prepared. Get prepared. All right, I sold all the wood. Is everyone proud of me? Yes, I did a great job. I did a great job. 